Hello Capricorn, welcome back to my channel. Let's talk about cards to see what the energy you are vibrating and you're working with this week. So Capricorn Collective message, Cosmic Egg and the Wolf. There is a new beginning. There is a sense of completion. There is a sense of moving towards something great, something bigger, something more positive in your life and you are very very much in your energy wall really represents a maturity a understanding a being like a parent a leader who actually looks into a new horizons who looks after the, um, the family who looks after everyone and also you know themselves um you are basically envisioning a greater future for yourself capricorn you're seeing that you know uh the completion that you have uh experiencing it could be emotional relationship you are now in a state where you understand the lessons that you have to learn you understand that there is a greater a greater reason for the things that happen in your life and now you are prepared to move on you are the leader you are embarking on something very very big and very positive and you know that um, and there is a karma involved and divine energy in this process but let's see what tarot cards has for us in place um, regards this energy what we can clarify three of swords queen of cups seven of swords and uh, six of wands so in the past you had the heartache and like i say you know the completion the fears of um not being able to trust of people uh who seems to be so genuine who seems to offer a lot of emotional comfort they are walking away you know with, with their promises and you know the whatever you know they have said you cannot trust any any longer and i think this this energy that kind of came from animal spirit, you know, about the new beginning, it really speaks about truly understanding the lessons, truly understanding, you know, these heartaches, you understand why these people acted the way they act. You are you are full of forgiveness. You are obviously uh, here. I see you as a queen of cups. I feel that you are you're going to a success, you're going towards, you know, a success, a much bigger promise for you, you know very well, you're actually sensing, because Queen of Cups, it's about emotion, senses, you're sensing that the people who have uh, not been uh, re really, you know, reliable, you you don't care, you just accept this is my, you know, my past, I with kindness and uh, all my emotions, uh, goodwill, I am accepting, I experience the joy and uh, I am experiencing the disappointments, but that's his life and I'm accepting that because I know that I have grown spiritually, I have grown um, physically, um, mentally on all levels and uh, I'm going to be the winner. That's, that's the energy that comes, you know, from these cards. Let's else let's clarify further this message with additional tarot. Yeah, new seeds are planted. Two of cups, two of sorry of pentacles, five of pentacles, and the hangman. So you are kind of, at the moment, I think you are really, really observing the whole situation, observing, you know, your past, observing your present, and really looking into the future. you kind of in this suspended motion of trust, the universe. You are not afraid to let it go of things that hasn't really worked. You, you are saying to yourself, you know, it's fine. I will walk away. Things that I have invested, I put, you know, my pentacle is fine to, you know, leave them behind, even though that I could, you know, 
holding them, I'm actually walking away and it's fine. You know that you have options, you know always there is a choice and the, you're playing really with the water and I would say something tangible. So maybe in the past where you know several options that you have to consider, but you are choosing yourself, you're choosing Ace of Pentacles, you're choosing invest in you, you're choosing to invest the emotions and time and energy and finance in you. But maybe you are really looking to step in into a very uh, strong role uh, career-wise. You know, you are actually contemplating uh, different scenarios, uh, how you can achieve that. And you know that you have now a lot of potential. You have worked on your creative realms and you know that now you can invest and properly put the strong seeds um, to manifest something, you know, bigger. So let's see if this uh, investment will be regards um, a work or more regards um, a relationship. Maybe you are giving a chance, a go for a person to come into your life or is it is it, you know, you investing in yourself? Like I say, you know, work opportunity. So let's see what the heart of fairies will tell. Yeah, you are very much investing more in yourself. You're leaving behind the temptations. You're leaving behind the sorrow. You're leaving behind all those, you know, things that wasn't really working for you. Things that have been, you know, coming from time to time as a temptation, lurking at the back, um, you know, in the shadows. And you're saying, you know, farewell, you know, goodbye, you know, all those temptations. I have fought a lot, worked on myself. I have no, no need to be immature. I have no need to be tempted in things that I know will never work. So you are turning your back on the temptations and as a fairy of the growth, you are really looking into how you can spiritually grow and how you can become that truth speaker how can you become a person that is more uh, aligned not only on the material on the world but as well emotionally because i think capricorn you are uh, one of those signs that uh most of the time uh, spend all your energy into work and i think you recognize that there is a need as well for emotional and spiritual growth and you are investing into this into this arena you know all your your coins um your energy and this is beautiful you see in front of yourself that the magic is happening you see in front of you that because that you start loving yourself because that you are accepting the you know the mistakes that happen in life you are forgiving yourself, you are forgiving, you know, those circumstances, you are forgiving those people and you feeling aligned, the singer of healing upon a wild daughters and yeah, look, she was the crew, crew, crew up. So what does it mean? It means, look, the singer of healing really talks about very strong alignment and actually you are in a healing process. You Capricorn went through a big journey you know, for the last, I would say, three, three, maybe four years, you are actually recognizing that there is in life much bigger things, uh, you know, to work, uh, focus. Um, you are no longer wanting to experience the insomnia and cry over someone who is just, you know, um, comes in life, you know, temporarily, uh, tempts you with, you know, your biggest desires, like, you know, sexual, you know, things or, um, you know, just to satisfy some sort of emotional needs that you have not really worked yourself on. Um, and, you know, this, this is fine because this energy is saying, you know, good that you recognize that these people were playing important role in your life and it's good that you are saying goodbye to these people that you're accepting with honor and gratitude and you're saying look i have so much you know still to to give the she of the crush is um 
a fairy of fertility, a fairy of um, a very fertile soil. So you are putting your coin, like I said, into something very, very promising, something that will give you big, big rewards. And you are the winner because look, we are actually clarifying on this six of wands, you know, the warrior that, you know, comes with a positive message. Um, so I feel that you might as well um, not only, you know, work on the spiritual self-improvement, but I think you are basically getting what you actually wanted. You know, you invested um, your energy and your coin into something uh, potential, you know, a, a dream. And your dream is going to come true in the next, you know, seven days. Um, because this is a very, very strong energy that really vibrates a karmic promise, a karmic, um, karmic lesson that you had to experience in order to find the alignment and happiness for yourself, Capricorn. So this is the message for you. I hope you enjoyed. Please continue watching, sharing, liking, help to grow my channel. If you want a personal reading, please get in touch. Uh, all information and details are in my about section. Thank you. Take care.